Well, I am excited to introduce you today to my good friends, Randall and Kathy White. They live out here in Goochland County, just a few miles west of Short Pump. They have a beautiful home, beautiful neighborhood. We're going to get to go inside and learn a little bit about what life is like here in Goochland. If you're new to this channel, welcome. I'm Greg Somerville, and I get to help lots of folks just like you moving in or to Richmond, Virginia, one of the best small cities in the U.S. To subscribe or to book a call, see the description below. I'd love to help you find your dream home here in Richmond. Randall. Greg, how are you? Hey, I'm well. Great to see you. Thank Great you for the you. greeting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excited to see your place. Well, it's a beautiful place. So glad you're here. We were mostly looking for the style of house. We had lived on 12 acres out in the country. It was a lot of work for Randall. It was a large home and we wanted to downsize and we wanted a place that we could stay up until the next stage of life, which we hope is 20 or 30 years away. We'll see. So I was looking for a good maintenance-free house. Uh, all that's here, and I can spend time uh, with my wife and uh, grandkids and, and golf. Uh, we were grandparents when we moved into this home, and so we certainly wanted a grandchildren-friendly area and a grandchildren-friendly house. Our neighborhood here is about 93, 94 homes. It's a great loop for the kids to ride bikes on. There's a little goat farm right up the street that we like to take the girls to, and they can, they're can they allowed to feed the goats up there. Yeah, my granddaughters, uh, I'm continuing to try to uh, nudge them towards uh, golf. I try to take them, again, about 10 minutes from here to the putt-putt, so we uh, do come up with some some fun things, uh, even walking up to the waterfall at the front. One of the reasons I wanted to have this house the way it was is that I wanted the grandchildren to have something to do here. During COVID, I had a lot of time to think, and we realized that there was some space underneath the steps. So we created an American Girl Doll playroom. So we do live in Goochland County. Goochland County is somewhat unique. It used to be very rural. So while we live in kind of Manic and Sabbath, which is inside now the village of Centerville, uh, Manic and Sabbath is quite a distance, 20 some, 25 minutes away from Goochland Courthouse, which is kind of on the other side of Goochland itself. So the development in Goochland has really uh, kind of blossomed. People. Believe it or not, we're trying to get away from Henrico County and Short Pump. When we grew up, we grew up here in Richmond. Short Pump was like two roads that intersected in the country. It is now huge. Anything you would want um, is in the Short Pump area. Yet, because of that, it's a lot of traffic. The advantage of living in Manic and Sabbath is we come in from the back end and go into Short Pump and the traffic is much less. So we uh, love the outdoors, and so we did decide to uh, put a little addition on back here during the afternoons as the sun sets over there. This is uh, really a nice place to be. We've always had a screen porch on all of our houses, and this has been delightful. This room was actually the dining room. So you walk in the house, the dining room's to the left. It was lovely. And then the room that where our dining room is currently was another sitting room. I just decided to flip-flop them because you could hear the traffic a little bit in that room. And when you're in the dining room, it doesn't matter. Whereas here, I like to sit, I can have my cup of coffee and my quiet time, and it's just a peaceful place. This is our tea party set. So this is where we have our tea parties pretty much every time the girls come. Um, this is Randall's rocking chair from when he grew up. It has his teeth marks on the back where he used to gnaw on it when he was a toddler and the girls get a big kick out of that story. Uh, the golfing options are plentiful. Uh, uh, within seven minutes, I can be at my club at Richmond Country Club. Uh, there's Hermitage Country Club, uh, that's probably six or seven minutes. There's Kenlock, which is the top course in uh, the area. Uh, for the public course, uh, Sycamore Creek 
within about two minutes. So there's uh, plenty of golf and you got plenty of time with everybody taking care of the yard. So that's, uh, that's been a real bonus for being here. That's our hokey bird. We love Virginia Tech. Randall and I both went there. Two of our three children went there. So we're gonna forever be Hokies and we just have to display it. Randall and Kathy, it has been a lot of fun seeing your house, hearing about your grandkids, finding the hidden spaces under the steps. <laughs> love it. I wish I were your grandchild. <laughs> I would love to visit. One of the things I love to do when I visit homes like this is to make a small donation on your behalf to the charity of your choice. Who can I give that to? Oh, well, thank you very much, Greg. So, uh, Elijah House Academy, it's a K-8 classical Christian school in the city of Richmond off of Jank Road. So that would be what we would choose.